Good afternoon, Hotline. Hey, how are you doing today? Hey, pretty good. I just uh, didn't know if um, a lot of people didn't realize it, but a good friend of mine and a good friend of the city, Jerry Casey, passed away. I, I saw that. Jerry used to run the state office building. Yes, and um, I don't think uh, a lot of people realize what an impact it had because before his tenure, um, the state office building was pretty much off limits. They had, um, at one time when it first opened, there was somebody that actually uh, contracted to run the 11th floor, which had a beautiful kitchen. And that fell through, and there was a period of time where it just wasn't used. It wasn't part of the community. Um, you know, a Lyric Theater, a Little Theater, the Antique Show, the Car Show, all of that can be credited with him. He actually he opened up the state office building to be part of the community and, and to, you know, to... Yeah, I remember Jerry. Good guy. Liked him. Yes, a great guy. And I, I don't think a lot of people realize that before before his tenure, that was an off-limits place. Yeah, I mean, it was strictly you go in there and and did what you had to do, and it, was, uh, it wasn't a place that was ours. And he turned it into ours, you know, uh, little things, putting in the fountain downstairs. I remember he had a greenhouse in the cellar. Uh, it, it's just, uh, he did so much. And it, it made it accessible. It made it our state office building. Because at the time, it, it was intimidating. You had this big, beautiful building, and uh, nobody really got to use it. But it's uh, just something I wanted to point out. I didn't know how many people realized that, but I uh, went through a lot of uh, the grief that he was going through at the time when he did open it up. I mean, there were problems with Union, who's going to write the, run the lights for the auditorium, and and he had a lot of hard-fought battles to be able to open that up to the public. And over the years, it just, you know, it, it became what it is now Yeah, with a different festival, so... Yeah. It's kind of a sad occasion. And, yeah. And, um, hey, if you know of any uh, lawyers who are looking for a part-time gig, the 